we're checking with Jess, let's check in with you. John had quite the view of the storm in gray earlier today. Perfect shot of storm clouds moving over Little Sebago. Thanks, John, for sharing this video with us. And remember, we always want to see what you're seeing. If you take videos or photos during or after storms safely, you can send them to us using the Near Me section of our new Center Main app. Got a shelf cloud there. Shelf so cloud. Good, I knew you were going to give us the science. Good shot it. there. Yeah, it's kind of that leading edge of the storm, obviously. But yeah, we had more storms tonight. I mean, it's been kind of active yeah. over the past couple of weeks for but sure. We have a little bit of a break. Yes, okay. which is going to be <laughs> awesome because not only are the storms out of here, the humidity is going to be much, much less tomorrow too. It's just going to feel better. Oh, yeah. yay. All right, <laughs> there's the storms off to our east right now. Mostly clear skies in our area tonight, and we'll see plenty of sun for tomorrow. More sun again as we head into the day on Wednesday, too. Look at this. Off to our west, nothing going on. That's good if you want some more sunshine. I know we still need more rain uh, across most of the state. We'll get that Thursday night into Friday. We'll get some rain, but tomorrow, Wednesday, Looking pretty good, pretty sunny out there. 68 is the current temperature in Sebago. Rumford's at 64, Lewiston's at 70, Arundel 71 degrees right now. Uh, Bangor's at 69, still Holton 67, Southwest Harbor 67 degrees as well. So temperature is pretty comfortable. Remember at this time last night, I believe we were in about the mid to upper 80s. Wild night last night as that wind kind of shifted around and came from the Southwest. Not so much tonight. Uh, temperature is a little bit more comfortable. Look at this, the dew points, they are crashing. Good news there. Our dew points today were similar to this mid to upper 60s, some low 70s. We we're kind of off the charts on one end and we're going to kind of go almost off the chart on the other end. Much, much more comfortable dew points. Now, as you're waking up tomorrow morning, if your dew points aren't already lower, you're just you're going to notice the difference as soon as you head out the door. I know still at the coast, you can still feel that that intense humidity, but really over the next few hours, things dry out significantly. It's just going to be a much nicer feeling day for tomorrow. Uh, temperatures 8 o'clock tomorrow morning. Most of us mid to upper 60s, some low 70s too. Things are looking up though as we head into the afternoon. A few clouds move in, but temperatures will be nice. Pretty much normal too for this time of year. We'll make it into the mid to upper 70s to around 80 at a couple spots farther inland. But it looks good for tomorrow. Most of us will stay dry. Very slight chance of seeing a couple sprinkles, mostly in the mountains and higher elevations. But Looking good for Tuesday, looking good for Wednesday too. Overnight Tuesday into early Wednesday. Temperatures cool back off down into about the upper 50s and lower 60s. Should stay pretty dry for the day on Wednesday too. Our temperatures Wednesday afternoon warm up again. Couple degrees warmer. Most of us should be able to make it into about the low to mid 80s as we head into Wednesday afternoon with plenty of sunshine yet again. Next chance for rain comes Thursday afternoon. You can see around lunchtime on Thursday, things are all good. We'll see that rain move through Thursday night into early Friday. Still a few showers lingering on Friday, but then it's going to clear out for the weekend. Saturday, Sunday right now, both looking pretty good. Seeds tomorrow around three to four feet. Winds from the west at around five knots, becoming southwesterly by uh, tomorrow afternoon. All right, tomorrow looks great. Wednesday looks great. Thursday afternoon into Friday, couple showers and storms. You'll notice temperatures kind of staying much, much closer to normal. Our normal high right now, uh, pretty much statewide, is right around 80 degrees. So that's pretty much where we'll be uh, as we go throughout the week. Only uh, thing kind of in the middle there is the, sh the showers and storms Thursday night into Friday. We're going to clear out, though in time for the weekend so things are looking nice next weekend we love to look ahead to the weekend on a monday don't we you always do you start that <laughs> countdown <know>. early yeah <laughs> all right jess thanks thanks